Preach the word. Yes. I'm here to talk about Uncle Henry. Uncle Henry. Uncle Henry. Uncle Henry. Uncle Henry. Wow. Uncle Henry. He was a good person. He was. Uncle Henry lived his life in a bubble. Yes, he did. Uncle Henry didn't know if he was coming in here if he was gone. No, he didn't. But you know what? We got to remember the good things about Uncle Henry. Yes. The good thing, y'all remember when Uncle Henry, he used to boo boo and had the little turds and stuff coming out of his throat. Yeah, Uncle Henry, you know, we used to lie for hours at that. Uncle Henry, he couldn't hold it. He couldn't hold it. Uncle Henry, Uncle Henry, Uncle Henry, he couldn't hold it. Yeah. But I'm here to tell you, <laughs> Uncle Henry lived a good short life. Good short life. A good short life. Good short life. Long life. A good. You see, Uncle Henry. He didn't do nothing to nobody. Mm -hmm. Uncle Henry went through life. He was just a float. Floating and in that bubble. In the bubble. He ain't bother nobody though. And you know, when Uncle Henry, when he when he took that leap to God, mm -hmm. he just floated. Yeah. He floated on to the top. To the top. To the tippy tippy tippy, tippy top. He ain't in pain no more. <laughs> hey, I just want to know, mm -hmm. anybody out there? Yeah. Is anybody out there? Yeah. Want to give Uncle Henry some words? I can have him say something. Thank <laughs> you. Be strong, sister. Be strong. <gasps> Uncle Henry, you lived with me, and I took care of you, and it's so hard to say goodbye to yesterday. The memories and good times, they fade away. Uncle Henry, we're going to miss you so much. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do this. I can't do it. Does anybody else have anything to say about it? Uncle Henry? Come on, I put him on my tank, put him on my dresser, and then I'll sleep in with him. We miss Uncle Henry. Matter of fact, matter of fact, y'all remember, y'all remember when Uncle Henry used to do this with his little. I can't even, I can't even, I can't, I can't look at it, I can't, I can't look at it, no. Any, anybody else? Oh, oh. Okay, here we go. Should listen to my mama when she told me to spend more time with you. But now, I can't. So I'm sorry. It's okay, little girl. It's okay, Nicole. Uncle Henry, Uncle Henry, Uncle Henry gone to a better place. Do you hear me? Uncle Henry, he gone to a better place. Y'all remember Auntie Meg, Auntie Meg, Henry the only one who used to make Auntie Meg feel special. Y'all remember that? Cause Auntie Meg, she yeah. couldn't cook. She couldn't cook. Auntie Meg was so bad at cooking. Yeah. She used to burn the bread. Tell it like it is. 
And guess what? Uncle, Uncle Henry, Uncle Henry gonna go eat that bread. Uncle Henry, you gonna eat that bread. And I know Auntie Mary, she gonna miss Uncle. She gonna miss. Amen. Anybody else got some words to come say to him up here right now? I uh, wanna say Uncle something. Henry. I know, I know we didn't spend that much time together, but the, but the times I did talk to you, I felt like you were actually listening, even though you weren't talking back. You always listen. I'm gonna miss you. And I'm here to tell all y'all today. I'm here to tell all y'all today. We miss you, Henry. We miss you, Henry. We miss it, Henry. And not a day, and God knows, not a day gonna go by. We ain't gonna think about Henry. Cause Henry, he was to your left. He was to your right. He was up. He was down. But guess what? Henry stayed in his lane. He stayed in his gap. He stayed in his little box. See anybody else? Cause I'm, I'm getting all teared. Ah. Anybody say something? Say it. Uncle Harry, why you have to go like that? But I know you're in a better place now. We gonna miss you, man. <laughs> Uncle Harry, you was the best to me. You was the only thing I really had. You stayed in your own little lane. And I miss you so much, Uncle Henry. Oh and I think my mama killed you. I ain't kill Uncle Henry. He was a lying little something. I ain't kill Uncle Henry. I took care of Uncle Henry. I ain't kill him. You killed my fish. First of all, you lucky I'm making us have this funeral for this goddamn old fish. And you gonna have the audacity to sit there and blame your mama? I ain't kill him. Wanna know why I know I ain't kill him? Because when I went downstairs, okay, all I did was I made the baby a bottle and then I walked back out to the room and guess what? The fish was alive. Cause you know who could have possibly did it? Your brother, cause you know he bad and he always was messing with the fish. I was asleep. He was staying up. Oh, hold up, wait a minute now, hold on. He was asleep. He was asleep. Cause I did check on him. So it was Caleb? It wasn't me. I was in my room practicing my backflips. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, I think it was Ari. Me? Y'all know how much I love animals? I never killed one. I was uh, outside doing stuff. It was Roman. Me? Man, you know I was in my room talking to Shayla all night. Mm -hmm. Thought y'all broke up. Oh, matter of fact, it was you, Jojo. Me? I mean, who even wear red to a funeral? That's my fish, and his favorite color was red. Mama, y'all all killed the fish. You 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 killed the fish. Pronounce ka ni gra. Now subscribe. <laughs> Ooh.
I crack myself up. Thanks for watching, because watching me is better than watching TV.